Hi, and welcome to my little review on the Skull Candy Chops. There's some nice headphones from Skull Candy. They're running about $25. I'll go ahead and tell you up front that for that price, they work. They're very good headphones. So let's get start looking at them. These headphones, all right, I'm gonna, I'll go ahead and read off the website. You won't be able to see them that well right now. They come in five, six different colors. Black on black, black on chrome, gray on white, purple. It's all purple, I guess, is what it is. They look a little, they look a little funky. And then the, the black, white on green, and then white and turquoise, which is what I have right here. So if you, when you take when you're buying headphones, if you take a if you take into account the specs on them, these have a 15 millimeter speaker, a frequency range of 18 to 20 thousand hertz, and the cable length is 1.2 meters, which I think might be a little long because like you get that you get the cord dangling from out of your pocket when you have it up in your ears, but it doesn't bother me that much. So let's get to it. You can see how big they are right there compared to the iPod Touch, which I'll be playing them out of in a second. So let's go ahead and look at them. I got the cool little Skull Candy logo, which looks cool when you have them on your ear. And you can see they're very nice. They've got these the, these flaps are very comfortable. They don't bother you too much. And so on the part that goes in your ear right here, you have you know, dirty hair. You have the um, you know, your little plastic covering over them over the 15 millimeter speaker. The plastic covering is nice when it's on right, but sometimes this little piece right on the bottom of it, which is kind of hard to like point out, it comes up like that, and it feels a little like loose in your ear. But when it's on like this, it feels it feels like you can't even feel it. It feels great. So the first feature that I think I really like is on it is how the is how you can put them on your ear and like the how the fitting of it. So let's say you're wearing them like this. Just here's the right, here's the left. I'll go and put the left down for a second. Like, if you have like a big ear, what you can do is you can do this. You pull this up like this, and then you put it on your ear. And then to get it on your ear nice and tight, you push that right, you push, push it back down, and it'll customize to your ear. Not customize, but it's kind of it fits on it really tight. So when you're running, you it doesn't dangle or move around at all. I use I've used it a bunch when I ran and gone to the gym. They look cool, they feel nice, and they have great sound. And I'll give you a little demo of the sound real quick. So I'm putting putting them on the ground real quick. Oh yeah, and the one thing I don't like is that for some reason this I don't know if it's just me, but this this little piece right here just seems a little long. Because when you're putting it to your oh, my camera's getting a little blurry for a second. When you put it into your iPod. It, Hangs out a little more than the Apple ones do. I mean, it's not that big of a deal at all, but I, this is one thing I found I didn't like as much about it. So, first of all, let's go to music. Alright, I have Lithium by Nirvana right here. Let's go ahead and put the volume up. You can get a little feel how loud these are. So the first time I put them in, I couldn't even, I couldn't hear anybody talking to me. They, they were almost like noise canceling, but it was just because they were loud. Alright, so I'll hold them up right here. I press play. And they're pretty loud. And so they're very nice. They're in your ear real good. Again, they're only about $25. And for the price, I'd say it's a pretty good deal. Some of the better headphones that I've used. Alright, thank you.